Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to play the Eldraine Courtside Brawl. This is going to give us our first look at the Eldraine set, which is actually pretty surprising to me. So you want to do cube later? Yeah, we'll do cube after this. I just want to uh, I want to give some give some initial thoughts, and for anyone who hasn't wasn't aware of this, you can catch it on YouTube and uh, what have you. So players want to receive. Be the first to play Throne of Eldraine in the special event using one of four pre-constructed decks in our newest format, Brawl. Play a deck built around a specific legendary creature or planeswalker, Commander, and play one-on-one -on -one games. You can learn more about Brawl by clicking here. Players will not receive the Brawl decks in their collection, but Throne of Eldraine cards shown below in rewards can be used in the standard 2020 event starting September 9th and in other events starting September 26th. Let's inspect these decks. Knight's Charge. Mike's charge. Oh, you got Sir Conrad the Grim. 5 4 for 5. Whenever another creature dies or a creature card is put into a graveyard from anywhere other than the battlefield, or a creature card leaves your graveyard, he deals 1 damage to each opponent. Each player puts the top card of the library into their graveyard. Okay. For 2 mana. We'll start with the leader, man. I don't know. Oh, I didn't even know where that. Okay. <clears throat> Sir Gwyn, hero of Asheville. Ashvale. Not to be confused with Asheville, which is a city of North Carolina. 5-5 five, five for 6 with Vigilance, 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 Vigi, Vigilance, and Minas. Whenever an equipped creature you control attacks, you draw a card and lose a life. That's interesting. Equipment you control, have equipped Knight 0. Oh, that's strange. So Knights cost 0 to equip. That's pretty good. I imagine there's a bunch of Knights in this deck. Venerable Knight. 1 for a 2-1 when it dies, but 1 when it kind of target. That card's great. Wow. This is a real upgrade to the 2-1 for 1. And we got Foulmire Knight. 1-1 one, one Death Touch. Okay, so Adventure says you may cast this card as an adventure after you do Exile. You may then cast the creature later from Exile. Oh, interesting. That is interesting. So I can attack with this, pay 3 to Exile it. <coughs> and then I can just play it again? Wait, you can... You can play it as a creature, then play the adventure, and then play it again? I don't know. It's don't not really so. clear about that. I guess not. <coughs> I would assume adventure is like... That's the exile part. You can only use the adventure portion from hand. Oh, okay. So you can't cast it in the adventure and then cast it again. Okay, so you can adventure and then still get a creature out of it later. <clears throat> That's interesting. <laughs> there are a lot of adventures. Order of Midnight, Smitten Swordmaster, Ember, Embreath, Shieldbreaker, Destroy an Artifact, and then you still can play it too. And these are actually great. Like this card, this is just... This is almost like... It's not strictly better because it's a sorcery. But like... I mean, you're paying to destroy an artifact, but then, like, you still get a creature out of it later? Like, that seems nuts. And Colossal Hammer seems pretty good with your commander. Oh, yeah, you're right. Because the equip is only zero instead of three. Alright, I'm actually just gonna play the decks. We can just probably play all of them, right? Because these seem sweet. Oh, I gotta pick one, though. You don't wanna look at them? I do, but I kinda don't. I kinda want to be surprised. Really? Yeah, kind of. You don't? I don't know, man. It's a format where I think you need to know your deck. Really? Because I just picked one, right? Okay, well, yeah, but if there's any, like, tutors or, like, go-to-find stuff, you're not going to know what to do. There's going to be tutors in these, in these sets. There might be. I ain't no tutors. I'm going to lower this arena volume, because I had to reinstall because my reformatted guys, remember? Oh, wow, that's really loud. I'm probably going to turn the music down. No, there's no music. Yeah, which is good. Ooh, Keeper of Fables. Whenever one or more non-human creatures you control do a combat damage, draw a card. Four, five, that's pretty good. I know you. <clears throat> I remember you. Yeah, this hand seems fine. Are we a Grixis deck? Or a Jund deck? Because, oh, we can play this like a commander? Yeah. Corvold, Fey Cursed King. This is a sweet-ass dragon. What is this, a dragon what? Dragon Noble? What do you do? Uh, whenever... We're playing against Hellface. Uh, that's... What is this symbol here? Oh, that shows your commander. So mine would say, like, bam. Okay, so... We drew a forest. I can play anything. Temple of Milady. Uh, yeah, I can keep that. Alright, so whenever it 
enters the battlefield or attacks, sacrifice another permanent. That's a that's a bit much. Whenever you sack a permanent, put a 1-1 counter on him and draw a card. Alright, that's not bad. I imagine there's like tokens to take advantage of that. Yeah, this looks like 100% of sacrifice what is there What does their, their bro do? What is their, what is their bro do? Flying Death Touch Lifelink, a 2-3 for good. 4. Other creatures get plus 1 plus 0, oh, and whenever you cast an artifact or enchantment spell, create a 1-1 one, one for fly fair. That's pretty good. That seems broken. I don't want to play anymore. They're not saving them for value. They have to play two of them. What? Oh, you mean the artifacts? Yeah, mm -hmm. they're like, <laughs> you're just throwing them out. You're just wasting your, wasting your fairies. Oh, an update's available for my Logitech option, so it's going to open right here in the middle. Ready? Mike P, go sleep now with the machine and report back. Wow. Or sleep on the stream with the machine and let us know how it goes. What does this guy do? This is so many spoilers. Shine Chaser, 3 minute for a 2-2, two -two. Flying Vigilance. That seems very good. Gets 1-1 one -one as long as you control an artifact. It gets 1-1 one -one as long as you control... Oh, so it's actually a 0-0. Zero -zero. No, it's a 1-1. One -one. And now that gets 1-1. One -one. Oh, so it's only a 1-1. One -one. Okay, that seems better then. That seems more balanced. I'm gonna play this fat boy. Fat boy! Coming through! Uh, no attacks, because that would be sad. 1-1 one, one, as long as you control our 1-1 one, one, as long as you control your save, not enchantment, so... Sleeping on the stream is against terms of service, which is a mic discrimination? Wow. Josh, of course! He killed your bro and grew his bro. I don't like anything that happened right now. Oh, well, I can just I can get rid of this, I'm sure. What if I can't? He killed your bro and grew his bro. So much bro... Uh, things. Stuff. Oh. 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 Come on. Do I get rid of the playcraft or the priest? Hmm. I think it's Plague Crafter. <coughs> Two extra power is not worth the versatility of this ability, I don't think. Let's bop him. Did we start at 25 life? Is that how Brawl works? You start at 25? Do you have any custom settings for your Logitech camera? Like in the camera configuration itself, right? Every week, you're going to learn your Um, <clears throat> yeah, that's a problem I struggled with for ages. The thing is, you have to actually... Uh, yeah, sure. <coughs> The thing is, you have to actually change the settings within, like, um, whatever the Logitech thing is. I don't actually know, um, I forgot what it is. Like, if you Google it, if you Google settings reset, you'll know it's, it's, it's a Logitech issue that's been there for years. Okay, so, number one, we're not going to do combat damage to a player. That's their, I guess we're just both playing commanders here, right? This is bigger. That's what... I have to sack a permanent though. That's rough. Oh, he's sitting on his little rock. Sitting on the rock. What did he do when he enters the battlefield too? Yeah. Ugh. I mean, it's supposed to be good though, right? Like, I mean, I imagine it's not like a negative thing. No, no, man. I don't like sacking perms. Yep. <clears throat> I also don't like sacking perms, but. Frogify? Uh, I believe the term is Brawler. This isn't Commander. Wow. Is that true? It's as true as you want it to be. I feel like our deck is not doing very good. I just picked the sweet Dragon Lord. You didn't even know what the Dragon Lord was until you played it. Yes, I did. I knew everything. You don't know nothing. God. So we can play two things, then sacrifice those things. If we proliferate, we're only proliferating on one thing, right? On our little dragon boy. Hey there, little dragon boy. This guy doesn't seem very exciting, unfortunately. Um, all right, we'll go mask. Oh. 
Do you have to pay more when you recast these guys, like commanders? I would assume so. I want them to block. Come on, Hellface. Really? You're just gonna take two Hellface? Is that what you're doing? <clears throat> they call me Hellface. Of love. Hellface. <laughs> Which is the night deck? Oh, the night deck looked very strong. Um, I guess I'm just passing here. I really don't feel like a... If we just use it, it's going to sack this guy, so that's whatever. Is there brawler damage? Like, is there damage that... No, because you started 25 life. So, if, just, if there's 21, it's like... What if they deal, what if they deal like 14 with their brawler? I guess that feels broken, right? Uh... Click proceed. Yes. Yeah. Why would I target any of my players? I'll target this player. I'm going to sacrifice our king, right? Uh, yes. I'll submit one. Okay, sure. Sacrifice two. I'll sacrifice you. And I guess Pollen Bright. Uh, command is there. Look at all this mana we're going to have. It's three beta. I would love a removal spell here. Can I get like a murder and I'll kill this? Kill the one one in response. Wait, what? Oh, that would have been really good. Uh, what does it say? Oh, it's no, it's any target. Wow, I just totally missed it. Because I don't know how that card works. Yeah, we definitely should have done that. That was smart. You're a smart guy. This is what you get for not playing Mask of Immolation. I forgot it was Mortar Pod. <clears throat> Four, five. Now it costs seven. Oh, so it does cost two more every time we recast it. But I do like that it tells you. That's so much easier than having to remember. Alright, that's enough. Are you gonna counter this? You got counter spells? Meow. Meow. Let's see if we can draw a card. Woo! Strong. See this? I drew a card. It's pretty good. Buddy, you know it's good. There's a Typhoid Rats with an Adventure on it. Okay. <clears throat> hey, Mike B, what sounds that cat thing make again? Meow. Oh, Workshop Elders. Seven mana for a 4-4. Artifact creatures you control have flying. At the beginning of <clears throat> combat on your turn, you may have target non-creature artifact. Become a zero zero artifact if you do put four one one count. Oh jeez. Well, that's pretty good. You just make four fours. Do they, do they fly? No. Okay, that's good. I guess. Yeah, they do. What? Oh, because his art. Text. Oh god. What? This deck seems broken. How do I compete with all this flying? Like. Nope, that doesn't do it. <clears throat> I'm putting stuff in a box. What does that mean? Why is their deck, like, significantly better than ours? Like, I feel like our deck wants to just, ima like, deal a bunch of one, like, one damage at a time. Like, this deals one, this deals one, this deals one, this deals one. But, like, they all cost, like, four and five. So I'm like, oh, it's taking for I can't get these out in any reasonable time frame. Yeah, stick sucks. It just seems way too slow. Animating fairy seems really good. I don't know what that is. So. It's probably Chion's fault. Wow. It's always, it's always Chion's fault. 
I only have one red too, so I can't even cast both of these, which is the only thing I can do two of. I wish this timer wasn't so aggressive when I'm like still learning all these cards, but I think we're just dead. Like we're gonna take ten from this guy alone. This guy's unbeatable. Yeah, we're just gonna concede here. I mean, if we sack the token to make a demon, we're going to nine. And then they're going to have two, five, and five as terms of flyers. We would have one blocker, so they can even attack with their four, four, and we still take five, five, and two. So we would still die. But you want to play the same deck? Can you, you can't change it, right? I'm in the event. Yeah, this is my deck. Wait. Oh. You can change it? Huh. All right, we'll give each one a shot then. I like it. Oh, that's something. I thought you were locked in. <clears throat> oh, joke's on them. <laughs> you okay, man? Oh, what is this? Turn back rounds? Oh, that's interesting. It's a Mardu land that you can only use the mana to cast a knight or an equipment spell. Seems good in this deck. What? Yeah, it seems great in this deck. Equipped, equip a knight costs one, equip a regular costs three, but it's a plus two, plus two? Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> Get him. Get an aggro. Well, you can't change mid game. Well. I'm putting stuff in a box. 2 1 with death touch. It gets toughness is equal to the number of knights you control. Whenever it attacks, another knight gains indestructible to turn. That's interesting. So I'm just gonna play. Well, we can't play this guy, unfortunately. Um, so we'll just play Lance here. Attack one. And the next turn we can equip the Lance. If they play an artifact, we can we can bust it up. That's not an artifact. That's a Death Toucher. Can I get rid of it? Not yet. Not quite yet. I don't really want to slam this guy into this. I'll be honest with you. Is it another target creature? Another target knight. All right, so I'll put on this guy. How do you grow your first gentleman? This one? Yeah. Uh, whenever, if, if an opponent lost four or more life, you should have counter on it. Okay. But you can also just pay three to get a plus three, plus three. Oh, look, they got a little golden egg. Sacrifice the golden egg. You okay? No. Are you, you're, looking, you're looking real sad. Do you want a hug? No. I'll hug you. Buddy, I will hug Thank you. Yeah. Spider View, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. All right, I'm attacking here. Ready? You kill their egg. I can kill their egg. Can't they respond by drawing a card or adding a mana? Yeah, I guess they could. Think we block here? Sure they are. Sure they are. I think I'm just gonna pump this guy. What are you doing? Why is it take cancel? Pay three? Oh, I don't have the mana for it. Never mind. I'm an idiot. That's sad. <clears throat> so I guess we'll pay. Play. Yeah, resolve it. Come on. Mike, do you want me to send you a happy hot dog? What's a happy hot dog? How do I. How do I distinguish that I want to cast this as an adventure? I've been on the stack and asked you. Yeah, nah, you're still smart. Just you wait. Get rid of your egg. Oh, these are great. I'm a fan of these adventure cards, man. Was that a command tower? The rich get richer. My god. Did you just death sprouted my guy? Mike B, it's a hot dog you eat, then you feel happy. Hmm. When, when have you ever turned down a hot dog? I haven't had a hot dog in literally like probably two years. Did you ever consider you're not having enough hot dogs in your diet? Oh, yeah, let me ask the doctor about that one. Hey doctor, should I eat more hot dogs? Knight's charge. Whenever a knight you control attacks, each opponent loses one and you gain one. Sacrifice it. Return all knight creature cards from your graveyard. Whoa. 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 Don't forget about your commander, bro. 
Well, we can take six. We only have four or five. This deck does seem good. Command Tower has an Eldraine common set symbol, which is weird. Is it going to be in packs? Oh, that is interesting. I don't think so, because then you draft it. They don't, they don't like putting cards in packs that don't actually do anything when you draft them. Like, you would just have this, and it literally does nothing in, in a draft, so... I would say no, it's not going to be in packs. 9 out of 10 doctors recommend hot dogs to fill your daily hot dog nutrition requirements. Yeah, if you, if you actually haven't eaten enough hot dogs, the one thing that can help is hot dogs, I think. Hmm. Just food for thought. Just hot dogs for thought, man. Well, I guess if it's for my health, then I guess, I guess I'll take the offer if it's for my health. What, do you, what else would it be for? Of course it's for your health. We're looking out for you, man. Is this any... Wait, what? Hot dogs are cool because you don't even have to chew them? Um... Hmm. <clears throat> Have you tried the new hot dog water frappuccino yet? Um. Maybe. Maybe you've tried it? Maybe. Do they have it at our local Starbucks? Probably. How, well, wouldn't you know if you've tried it? Who's to say? None of these are answers. <laughs> no, I haven't tried a hot dog water frappuccino. That's disgusting. What's plus two plus two? It makes it five, two, two, three, four. Yeah. That's, that's, but they're not. It's not a token, right? So. Actually, still three. Come on, Judith. So she can do one here. Yeah, and then, then everybody dies. Then the whole board. What? Oh, that's. That was a mistake. Man, nice burn. Got you him. gave him the oops. I did. It's your boy! We have to sacrifice permanent. Why would they sacrifice that instead of only six lands? Maybe they need the lands. <laughs> Excuse me. Hey, buddy. Keep it down over there. This is flash equipment. When it enters the battlefield, attach it to a knight. Equipped creature gets plus 0, plus 2, and has vigilance. Whenever a crypt, a qu an equipped creature you control attacks, you draw a card and lose a life. That just seems good. It's not bad. I mean, but I don't want to attack with this guy because then it just dies, right? So. Yeah. Why doesn't she have haste? And I'm also almost tempted to just let them die so I can actually activate this when I have eight. Wow, you need to really take it easy. This guy's bumping mics over here. Oh, wow, look at this. Look at this. Look at this infogram over here. 46 cards in the library, one card in hand, three in the graveyard, zero in the. In the time, in the uh, in a, in a time paradox, I guess we're just passing here. The shadow realm. <laughs> but my my grandpa gave me those those cards. <clears throat> just you wait. And that comic series is great. What? You the aliens. Aliens? aliens? Yeah, on the Facebooks. Oh, these guys? Yeah, this yeah. is one of my... Yeah, it's, I, I love it. Are they going to Brontodon one of our things, you think? Hey, man. Hmm. See what that hurricane is now? No. That's not how you spell that at all, but you got it. It's like all the way up here now. It's already gone. Like, it's nowhere even close to us. It looks like it's not really going to affect too many people anyway. Just some people on the coast. Yeah, this hurricane was nonsense. What does this guy do? Other knights you control get plus one, plus one. Oh, baby. That's broken. That card's broken. I think it's... It's fine. It's broken. Okay, well... God, look at all these knight triggers. Draw a card and lose a life. Michael B. Do, 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 do. Uh, 
Um, who's blocking? Who is this blocking? You're blocking this guy, so I'm dealing five. I guess I kill both. I'll put you in the front. So what is this? Three, four, five? So I can actually play armor here? Oh, turkey, got turkey. him. What did you say? Tricky, tricky. I thought you said turkey, turkey, and I was like, turkey, turkey. turkey. Ooh, turkey, we got turkey. four heraldic turkey, banners. Turkey. As an enters the battlefield, choose a... I'm trying to read this card. Stop singing your turkey song. God. <laughs> <laughs> Creatures of the chosen color get plus one, plus zero. Oh. Add one mana of the chosen color. That's actually not bad. It's just a three mana mana rock that like also acts as kind of a. Is that you? Hmm? Is that you? What the noise? Yeah. Okay. It also acts as like kind of an anthem. It's definitely an anthem. Well, it's like a half anthem. Anthems are usually plus one plus one, you know. You know what I'm saying? No. Do you feel me, bro? I'm gonna go make a little kufifi. I see what you did there. Oh yes, look at this deck. I'll keep this. It's a little slow because we have um, two guild gates, but still. Are you guys looking at pictures of Dorian? Oh, I was just looking to see where it was right now. And it's literally nowhere that I'm concerned about. Let's sleep off of this guy. Dorian Gray is a bit of a stretch from that. Um, so actually, let's just play Arcane Signet here. I was going to play uh, Zorius Gildegate, but I'd rather play this because next turn we can play like Risen Reef. This fairy is nuts. I'm a real big fan of this card. When it enters the battlefield, it's an artifact, I assume, because it's got a little... When it enters the battlefield, untap a, an artifact or a creature you control. So it's a 1-4 for 2, which is actually pretty good by itself. Let's play old Risen Reef. Oh, yes, look at us. We're doing it. What if Gaia Skyfolk was also... Yeah, right, Like that's what I was like. I'm like, is this just a Gaia Skyfolk that can tap for two different colors of mana? Because that seems pretty good. I'm no expert. Just kidding, I'm an expert. Trust me. Trust me, I'm a doctor. <clears throat> Thorn Mammoth. Whenever it or whenever it or another creature enters the battlefield under control, it fights up to one target creature you don't control. Okay, so it's just a fighter. I'm just a fighter. I think it's just Shark to Crab. What does this guy do? Whenever you cast a creature, you'll draw a card and you have a land card from your hand on the battlefield. Yeah, we're just playing this guy. I'm a survivor. I'm going further. I'm going harder. I'm going harder. Why do we? Why would this deck play Guild Gates over the the gain life lands? What is this? Plus one for each artifact or enchantment you control. So one. So it gets plus three, plus three. No blocks. Well, we're definitely tapping that guy down, drawing a card, doing a thing. Biomancer is familiar. Bam!
Bam. <laughs> That's pretty sick. Uh, what do we got? Island, one, two, three, blue, one, two, white, one, two, green. We'll just get green, because green seems very heavily utilized. This guy vigilant? Yes. Excuse me while I guess the sky. Oh, guess we have blossoming sands too? That's weird. Is oh are these only on color? Well no, because then Azori Skilled Gate. There's no reason to have Azori Skilled Gate over at Tranquil Cove, I guess. Um 4-7. How do we deal with that? I guess we play this. Tap down that gentleman. Uh, wait, how much mana do we have? One, two, three. It's not a lot. Putting lands, putting this many lands into play is pretty bonkers. Um, you can probably put it on the top of your library. I'll, I'll take in race foreigners for sure. Um. And we still have three man up, so we can actually activate Chu Lane's ability if we want to. I'm pretty sure we just win with Enray's four runners, right? Oh, they all play both. Gotcha. Gotcha. I see what's happening. What does this do? I'd love to see what this is. Undrempt Tuna, what's going on? This is uh whenever a creature control attacks alone. Okay, so it just gets like super exalted. Um this is the Thrones of Eldraine event on Magic Online, which is super weird because uh, no blocks. Are they dead? How do they How do they not die to end race four runners here? I mean, they're probably not dead dead, but this is still a lot. I guess they have one block. Seven, eight, nine. Oh, okay. Well, see you later. They could have blocked the seven, seven. Oh no, his trample. Never mind. Did they all get trample? Yeah. They can block one trample damage out of a bajillion. Oh, for Sir Conrad, which we know about. Okay, so. Um, let's try the Fairy Schemes deck now. I'm a survivor. I'm gonna work harder. I'm gonna go give up. I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up. I'm gonna mac me. He's making coffee. He's in the kitchen. Yeah, sand seems fine. Oh, Shimmer Dragon. Someone said uh, Shimmer Dragon is a card. What doth life? We'll find out. 5 6 for 6. As long as you control 4 more artifacts, it has hexproof. Tap 2 untapped artifacts you control. Oh, wow. Oh, that card seems bonkers, dude. Just yesterday morning. They let me know you were gone. So many golden eggs. <laughs> what is it? What is a witch's oven? Sack a creature, create a food token. If the sacrifice creature's toughness is four greater, create two food tokens. Oh wow, they're bigger, so they get more food out of them. It's feisty outside. Undrop tuner, are you okay? I was gonna message you and ask uh, to make sure you were safe. But here we are. But I just checked the map, and it looks like Jacksonville's not. So Super uh, threatened, I guess is the word I'm looking for here. Leyline Prowler. Let's play this guy. Um, equipped creature gets plus one plus one for each charge counter on Mace of the Valiant and has Vigilance. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under your control, put a charge counter on Mace. Okay, so you just... Wow, that's pretty good. This is the only real thing we can cast here. Just watching movies and eating snacks. Wow, you consider my stream a movie? That's really 
I love that. That's nice. Oh, Michael B. He lives in a tree. Playing the fairies? Yeah. We won the last game. We had N-Ray's Forerunners. Look at all the treasures they got, though. Yeah, man. I, I, I get it. Okay? They're rich. Okay? Did you see I streamed last night? It went pretty well. I don't know why I didn't get a notification when you streamed. Well, uh, not trying to advertise my stream here or anything. Just want to let you... Josh, it's okay, dude. We're friends. It's not... Don't even worry about it, man. I kind of be like, can you fucking believe that guy? Advertising his stream on me? On That's here? messed up, man. That's unbelievable. How can you be that rude? I'm streaming here. <laughs> unbelievable. Also, this is the fidget spinner cover by Mike, so... There's a still shot of it. It's literally against the Twitch terms of service to advertise your stream on someone else's. I would never, yeah, but if, if they actually did something about that, I would be like, hey, it's cool. We good. I'm just going to play this lady. Well, that was pretty sweet. I was a fan of that animation. Michael B lives in the tree. Can't hurt me. Cool, are there fidget spinners on the end of the fidget spinners? Yeah, they're tiny little gears. Uh, no blocks. Oh yeah, Monsanto's the worst. I hate that guy. He's basically the, the scummiest scumbag there is. Can you I, spit it on your finger not holding the other side? No, I'm not that cool. Why why don't you get that cool? It's too much, man. Does he got vigilance? Flying death touch and lifelink. No creature control is actually some creature control, so it's only in plus Oh actually we're gonna make a fairy, right? I like it a lot. Oh, that's life we're gaining. Are they playing the Jun deck? Yeah. Got flying, right? Sucker. Oh, wow, I didn't even realize that. He just spin on the surface. Oh, my God. Badger, what's going on, my dude? Oh, dragon. Oh, he lands on some rocks. I didn't see that before. Well, that's pretty good. Mike just got some coffee, so. Not the greatest coffee, but it'll do. That was a lot of damage, but it's okay. We're gaining a lot of life. It's okay. It's okay. <clears throat> so you're one away. As long as you control four more artifacts, we have two artifacts. Dang it. What happens when you do have four? My dad. Oh, your dad happens. My dad. You can fortify his commander. I'm just going to sack it and get f two food tokens. And they're going to deal us a damage. I mean, we could do that, though. I'd rather just play this big fat dragon, right? Nah, I kind of want to get rid of it, I guess. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under your control. Oh, so we're going to play this first. Pop that. Make a fairy. I guess then they get to sacrifice this guy, though. Now they're going to do it. The problem is they're going to sacrifice this to this, which is going to trigger this, and they're just going to shoot one of the fairies. And then whenever they sack one of the food tokens, they're going to sack it, they're going to kill another fairy. What if they don't? Oh, that'd be cool. I would <laughs> like that a lot. Well, they did, so... Yes, I've, I've went over this before. Green games feel longer, even though they're shorter. Uh, because every individual action has so much more response.
I like how your chant got messed up. Modern cube. Modern cube. Modern cube. I love a good modern cube. Michael B's playing with so his. Evidently something's wrong with your UPS delivery. Yeah. That's sad, man. Were we talking about that before? Yeah, but I came in late to the conversation. Well, you know what they say. Better late to seal the date. So you just got it turned off or whatever? No, it's not right now. It's right, in, it's right underneath you. But it's not making a weird noise anymore? Right, now it stopped, so I don't know what's going on. I could turn it off for you with my toe if you want. Ooh, I think I'm good. I appreciate the offer, though. That does sound good. Kaya's Wrath? I feel like I'd take a million damage if I Kaya's Wrath here, right? Whenever another creature dies or a creature deals one damage to each opponent. So, one, two, three, four, five. I take six. And then whenever a player sacrifice. Oh, that's, that's sacrifice. Move that. I take six from that. I think that's worth it. Is it, though? How many artifacts do I have? Three? I need one more artifact for this guy to be really, really bonkers. What is this? I'm gonna just, I'm gonna try to hit a land here, and then we're gonna equip this thing. Okay, we did that. Michael B's living in a tree. Oh, you didn't do that. Did you say me? You're getting wrath. No. A bold choice. Why is that a bold choice? We can do better. We're on like we're at twenty. Like I'm not super. Are the new cards on arena? There's like four uh, pre-con decks that you can play at this event. We're actually twenty-two. I want you to stop talking right now. Michael B. He lives in a tree. Do you know what? Slip a dip do. Michael B. Ch -ch -ch live in trees. Michael B. Live in trees. Oh look, it's a diva. Yeah, see, this is a better board to kill things on. I'm probably just gonna block here, gain the life link, and then, you know, bonk it in and bonk it out. So we're taking ten, but gaining three, so we're taking seven. Uh, what's better? Probably command zone, right? I can't imagine I have a way to get her back efficiently. Are we just dead now? Because of because of the Judith? What does this thing do? Four beautiful colors. Three, three. When there's a battlefield, look at the top four cards of your library. You may fill an artifact or enchantment. Put it into your hand. Put the rest. So it's just four. Like it's just four colored mana for a three, three flyer that draws you a card. Not terrible. Andrem Tuna with the gifted sub? Oh, jeez. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. All right, so... Um... <laughs> Hello. All right. Oh, crying out loud. I think we're dead if we cast this, right? One, two, three, four, five. Is it one another another? We gotta oh. say it, man. I don't have to do anything, man. You don't want to welcome the Busta? <laughs> That's not even a real name. That's fantastic. 
Oh god, what a time to be alive. What kind of Buster Mike? <laughs> oh, I steal your thunder, man. Oh, it's mine, eh? Hey, you do have to welcome them to the Salt High Brood. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at all these triggers. I actually got an 8. That's not as bad as I thought it was. Alright, this is good. I think we're doing okay. Look how much food they have. This is so much life. Oh my god, you need to relax. What if I just shattered? I don't think that'd be good. I feel like that would actually be negative. That would be bad. I spent money on this. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, God. I'm having, a, I'm having a sweat over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana. Is it just this guy? Four, four, and then just make things float? Or we can just play Safari, right? Which seems pretty nuts, I guess. First there was a sweat, then the epic. Remember that one? That was a, that was a solid gentleman there. I don't even remember what that was about. It was about the sweat and then the epic. I guess that's true. Yeah, I feel like every food token just negates... I mean, it's not like I feel this way. Every food token negates one lightning bolt or something, which is just insane. I mean, you have to you have to tap two to do it, though. Well, they're tapping two for the lightning bolt, you know? So it's like, if they're spending their mana... Like, it's, it's almost... It's a proportional cost, you know what I mean? So you're not, like, spending four mana for three life while they're, like, pulling ahead. Clint Busta. Yeah, let's go with that. Is um, that better? I don't know. Why do I want to block either of these? I guess we'll find out. They could just create a food token to prevent us from getting the life, but... Okay, so seven life is pretty juicy. I assume they have a four damage spell here. Or they just don't know how to deal with this, so... Oh, that's so sad. Well, that was pretty good. So one, two. God, I only have two artifacts. One, two, three, four, eight, nine mana. So I can go six, seven. No. How many things they have? Is this gonna be like an artifact farm where you have like a million things? So we have one, two mana, we'll play. Actually, I might just wanna save this until we play this. Got him. Can you imagine if they died when they have like nine life on board? Uh, uh, 12 life on board? Are you falling asleep? Hmm. I had good sleep, man. Did you? Yeah. How do you know? Your tiny mouth probably wasn't getting enough oxygen, you know? <clears throat> Can someone Photoshop Mike's face but make, a, make his mouth even smaller? Wow. Can you just put a really small mouth on his face? I'll probably do that in like two seconds. Just shrink his mouth. All of Thrones out? No. Just uh, there's just an adventure. 
Adventure with adventure cards. Oh, Mike B, when you talk like that, you make me go back. Mm -hmm. Um, Shut up and take yeah, my I'm six here. <clears throat> One Busta bug. <laughs> oh, from Clint Busta. Thank you so much, Clint Busta. Really appreciate it. Wow. His mouth is already only one micron and we can't make it any smaller. That's really too bad, man. I'm so sorry about your tiny mouth. Tiny mouth. Wow. Take my mouth. Someone photoshopped Mike's face onto the food token because Mike B is a snack. Wow. 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 One, two. So what, we can attack for like... Does this guy have lifelink? How are they back at 12? Oh, they ate some food? Yeah, okay. That's fine. <clears throat> How do we deal with this guy? That's the question. Once you attack, isn't it like a 6-6? Six, six? Oh, yeah. That's a good point. One, two, three... Oh my god, every time, dude. Come on. Come on, you can do better. Let me just move the mic a little bit. Um, if I take action, does it unequip? I don't know. I guess it does. Well, shucks. Oh, the baking pies will be good with Sahili. <clears throat> I guess you can make food token copies. I don't even know what that means. How much you ever played format All Star March of Machines, Frank? I've uh, no, I've never played that before. What's that card do? Don't know if you're trolling or not, buddy. I'm 400 years old. Of course, I know what March of the Machines does. 400 years old? Wow. This game's only been out for like 26 years, man. I don't know if you need Yeah, to... so I would know it even more, wouldn't I? But it, it's not... Why don't you think about it? Are you thinking about it right now? But it's, but you, but it, but it's not. But, but I don't. didn't. But you don't. But I did. Yeah, that's a big-ass dragon. Frank finally revealed his age on stream. Wow. <laughs> well, I didn't want to brag. Just kidding, I did. Mike keeps on spinning, spinning, spinning into the toilet. You're spinning into the toilet? Yeah. Into the toilet? And yet Mike's still so much older. Well, well, what can you do? I'm gonna fly like a Mike B. Let the Mike B's carry me. Well, that was a sugar pocket. A sugar pocket? Yeah. In your coffee? Yeah. I had sugar pockets in my coffee and... You're so vain. Probably think this coffee is about you. Oh, it's ten ten now. Pocket. How does it keep growing? Because whenever you sack a thing, it gets plus one plus one. And you draw a card. Oh no. Yeah, dude. It's a solid. It's That's a fatty. A boy. It's a bit of a problem. Or it's six. I got two floaty blockers. It doesn't have trample. You're lucky. I'm just gonna chump it, and then we'll. Then we'll dump it. Oh, I forgot about this guy, too. That's problematic. <laughs> Are you okay? What are you laughing at? I think I'll live. You think you'll live? What if you don't, though? What happens then? But then again, maybe you won't. But then again, I found something did a bit did do. I thought I recognized that. Dan, man, what's going on? It's funny when people recognize me from the YouTube videos, because uh, I have a pretty extensive magic resume. Um, so we're going to jump here, and then we're going to double block this gentleman here. I think it's so funny because I'm like, well, I've written for TCG Player for nine years, and I wrote for Channel Fireball for two years, and uh, I have a Pro Tour Top 8 and a Grand Prix Top 8, and I was at the Community Cup in 2014. But, um, yeah, my YouTube videos are cool. 
So that's just funny. What brought that up? Well, because someone said, uh, hey, I've seen your YouTube videos and I recognize the name. So it's just funny, like, if that's what you recognize me from. Because I'm like, mm. man, that's so... It's, I feels like, what am I doing wrong? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, not everyone follows the professional scene, though. It's okay. They're at 21 Life. Okay. <laughs> just the rest of the no, no, no. It's totally cool. I'm not like, I'm not saying that it's like, uh, it's not, it's not a bad thing. It's just funny. It's funny to me because I'm like, man, that's where four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine mana. This is six. Better hurry up, boy. I know. It's like really kind of frustrating because I'm like, these are new cards. I don't know what I'm doing. Definitely want to cast the floater. Well, we have multiple floaters, so I can go four, eight, this. Yeah, I'll just use a timeout. That's fine. And now we can cash Wish and Whale. But that's the only thing we can cast, unfortunately. So we can cast oh, the token. What? Makes a token. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. And also, um, we get to scry. Um, yeah, that's fine. We can keep both of those. You kept a land? I want more land because I'm doing stuff, Michael. I'm doing stuff here. You're gonna die if you don't answer that draggy. Does he have a cell phone? Can I call can I call him? Yeah. Go to the attackers. This guy's friggin' humongous. I mean we're probably just chump blocking there if they don't have an answer. I am trying to make his mouth smaller in Photoshop, <laughs> but it's hard to make it smaller. It already is so small. Wow. Here's a very small Fantastic. End of the turn. That thing just attacked for 10, man. They have four cards in hand. Yeah, Death Touch is an answer. So is Life Link. So is Life. Lifeums, McLinkums. How much does this cost? Two? So for six mana, are they gonna shoot my blocker? Yeah, that will happen if you don't get your daily dose of hot dogs. Wow. I don't know how you get the hot dogs in your in your mouth when it's that small, though. You know what I mean? Oh God, are we just dead? Oh, this is disgusting. I felt so good too. Yep, they deal us one, and then this guy kills us. Yeah, this is... Wow, this game was close. Yep. Mask of Immolation did the deed. Did your dad give you... Did your doctor give you some, some mouth stretching exercises? No. So you can eat hot dogs? Hey, Kurt, you better not send a hot dog because apparently my mouth's too small to eat it, so. It's so sad, man. I'm really sorry about your tiny mouth. <clears throat> and we died. Alright, let's go back to. Let's go back to the Knight's Charge deck. This one Wait, was fun. Wait, we're not going to do the other one? Which one? This one? There's like, yeah, there's a bunch I, of different I options. did them all so far. You were just gone. The one I won with was the one with N Race Forerunners, which is the one you probably didn't see. But you played the Bayon one? Yeah. That is, did you do well? I won with it. It must have been quick. I wasn't making coffee that long. It was, you were gone for like 10 minutes. How much to join this event? Uh, it's free. Oh, uh, this hand seems bad. It'll be $10 to me, though. So send it, send it over Al, to www.mitchellb.com slash donate. What is this fire? My, Mitchell, MitchellB.com slash donate. Fireborn Knight, 2-3 is double strike. It gets plus one, plus one for four mana. Good lord, that's expensive. So I can play this, and then I can just automatically equip it to this? Yeah. That's <clears throat> pretty good, right? It's something.
Well, you know what would be nice here? Black mana? Correct. Oh, black mana. Black, black. Oh, black mana. Black, black. You like my song? Yeah, that was pretty terrible. Wow. It's not your fault. I mean, it's just not It's just not good, you know? It's your, it's your tiny mouth and your small brain. <laughs> I heard the, the mouth size is proportional to the head size, to the brain size, so... Oh, wow, this is fantastic. You want to see something cool? Destroy your artifact. You know what's weird, actually? What's tell me? Did you know that brain size is not actually proportionate to intelligence? Maybe yours isn't. Wow. Got him. <laughs> well, didn't you go to the doctor and your, your doctor said your brain was the size of a walnut? No, he never said that. I thought that's what he said. I thought he said your brain size was the same as your mouth size. Who can tell, man? It's hard to remember. Because <laughs> of the because the brain size, right? Yeah. That's rough, man. Hey, man, where are we eating later? Oh, uh, I don't know. That sounds good. Shambling suit has power to number artifacts or enchantments you control. So, so one. Okay, that's still not. Just to be clear, that's still not a. A black land. Let's get this guy all hasted up. What about T bus? So, I don't know. It's still Mexican. It's a different form, though, you know? How is it a different form? It's like traditional. Traditional? Yeah. What does that mean? You gotta eat the lettuce. Shambling suit sounds like my boss after a long meeting, am I right? I don't know how your boss sounds after a long meeting. How would anyone know your boss? <laughs> Get it together, mossy beard. Lebo, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. <laughs> Is that turtles all the way down? I'm going to go get a, a swamp, if you can believe it. Oh my god, so we can actually go like play this, equip both of these, and just smash for 16? Disgusting. Are you gonna? I was like, are you gonna counter my evolve? No, what's happening here? Get Lorge? I don't know what's going on. There's one turtles misspelled. have a stroke looking at it this closely okay so we're one mana shy oh that's messed up you lied yeah what a liar I learned I went through every one very carefully I looked at all the turtles I'll have you know all right, let's get in there with that Kill this before they do some broken, some broken nonsense. Oh, you just got rid of that guy? Shh. Buddy. <clears throat> what Carabas? It's a little too rich for my blood. Oh, I see. Why would you use the black for that? Oh. Classic. That's frustrating. <clears throat> All 
All right, well, <clears throat> this is gonna be bonkers. Jeez, 19 damage. Seems reasonable. <laughs> it's okay, it's only a 16 15 with vigilance and menace and haste and flying. Oh, can't get flying. Okay, your move. Man, if only we had a knight out last turn, we could have put a counter on it. It would have been a two-three. It would have gotten another counter from the from the damage. Oh, that's unfortunate. I guess command. Okay, go back up to four. We're getting there again. Alright, those are knights? Oh, both these are knights. That's nice. Must be knights. No. Oh, no. Cancel. Go for one on the Tajikajik. Can I do that? Oh, it's a soldier? Oh my god. Why are you a soldier in this deck? Get out of here, my dude. Sure. Well, that's pretty insane. I guess ours is bigger though. I guess they can just jump it though. I guess like we just put this on here, right? Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Because this guy's not getting in there. Or we can move this over to here. It's got death touch, so they can just double block here. Yeah, that seems better. I had that previously. Shivan Dragon? Well, 
Well, that's pretty cool. Is it? It's a shipping dragon, man. Who gives a crap? Wow. Who gives a crap about a shimmin' dragon? Yeah. Good lord, man. Does this cost five, six, seven? This costs eight to cast? One, two, three, four, six, seven. <clears throat> wow. So if we have another land, like, we just win, right? Because we can just cast this and... Single combat. She's a creature of planeswalker that control sacrifice the rest. Well, I don't love that. <coughs> oh boy. I guess we'll play this guy. Keep up response resurgence. Oh, I, I forgot we had this. Oh, yeah, that's terrible. I totally forgot about the haste because, like, this is hiding behind the law mage's binding. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you can do this for five and still equip like a Marauder's Axe. Hashtag two combats. just happened there? Oh, wait. What just happened? This is a 3-2. This is a 2-4? Okay, so it just blocked it. Sure. Um, that would have been nice if I had the mana for that. That was interesting. Do you have food? One, two, three, four, four mana. So, one, two, three. We have one card. This doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. None of these do anything. OK. 
Okay. Got him. Woo! That was close. Oh man, look at all these things. Fairy Vandal. 1-2 Flying Flash for 2. Whenever you draw your second card, put a 1-1 counter out. That seems very good. We're not Modern Cuban until we're done here. God, take it easy. Gotta get them six wins or whatever. Five wins, six wins, whatever. I need to refill this drink too. Um. Oh, I, I kept I kept the same deck. It's fine. Return creature from your graveyard to your hand. That seems great. This deck does seem good. A free mulligan, sure. Oh, that seems great. Hundred percent in. Boros Skilled Gate or Windscarred Crag? Let's go with the Lifey Boy. This is strictly better. Yeah, that's true. It is strictly better. Actually, oh god. He's if you have Maze of Zith, it's not strictly better. Or not Maze of Zith, Maze's End. That's true, because Boros Skilled Gate has a function. Because Boros Skilled Gate has a function. But I hate you so much. That's true. Get a little slipper out. Oh, yeah. Same, except it's night here. <laughs> wow, you guys don't have to fight about the, the time of day, okay? Day and night. Night and day. It hurts to live, Michael B. this way. Uh, oh, I was thinking of another song. Enters the that battlefield with page counter on. Whenever a commander enters battlefield or, sta or attacks, put a page counter on Tome of Legends. Remember page counter draw card. That's interesting. Wow, that's really good. Oh, whenever your commander. Okay, that's significantly different. I thought it was whenever a commander, and I was like, that card seems busted. Day and night. The lone loner sends us free as mine at night. At, at, at night. What? Michael B. lives in a tree. Mike needs a white shirt so he can sing Ebony and Ivory. Oh, good old Chew Lane. Oh, because he's got a black shirt on? I see you. I do have a white shirt. I see you. I'm just going to despark this guy because this guy is a crazy ass engine. That's just some child cuddy, Franklin. Wow, child cuddy. I wonder why he didn't name himself that instead. Cuddy is the name of House's love interest on, on House. Really? Yeah, Dr. Cuddy, Lisa Cuddy. You don't know anything about House. She's not like one of the main members, right? Yeah, she's one of the main characters. Hmm. She's literally the Dean of Medicine at the hospital he works at. She's like the... She's the one with the curly black hair? I'll just look her up. I'm just trying to remember. Yes. Okay. Yeah, she's like the main. She's like one of the main characters. It's not really curly hair, but all hair looks the same to you, Mike. I'm sure. <laughs> fairy formation. Five four for five flying. Create a one one blue fairy token with flying and draw a card. Oh Jesus! You had me at the one one flyer, and then said draw a card afterwards. Holy shit! That card's nuts. I hope you're enjoying your view then if you can see I am naked. Wow, good for you. I don't know what that means. I don't know what's happening. I feel like I just need to kill this like right now. It's just too good. It's unbelievable. Did you hear that? I did. It's UPS. It's UPS, guys. It's okay. It's only the UPS guy. You guys oh, want you need to fix your thing? You need a better quality one. Do I just play this guy? Is that a 2 flyer? 
I don't think so. And that freaked me out. The truck drove by, but, for, but in the corner of my eye, it looked like a person was like standing in front of the window. That's that creepy. Out. Yeah. Everyone thinks it says Rent a Rhino at the bottom. Wait, what? It says Rent a Reno. But everybody oh. thinks it says Rent a Rhino. And I think I've just embraced the meme, so when I when I write it, I just assume that's what people are going to think now. Oh god, Meteor Golem. That's the that's the that's one Meteor Golem. God, I love drawing cards. Have you ever drawn cards before, man? No. It's an unreal experience, my friend. What does this do? 2 1 lifelink. Uh, one black, you gain X life, and each one loses X life for X number of knights you control? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, man, knights are gonna be bumping. Well, it doesn't save mana yet, though, right? Because, like, this is gonna cost two, and then this is gonna cost six when we recast it, so. But it lets us divide the eight mana over two turns. But I'll probably just get back Midnight Reaper, to be honest. Midnight Reaper, keep on rolling, Mississippi Moon, would you keep on shining on me? I hear you, man. Doo, doo, doo. Which guy? This guy? This guy does kind of look like the dude from Shrek. The king? Was it the king? Oh, yeah. I know what you're talking the about. prince? I don't know his name. Dumbledore? You say Dumbledore? Yeah, you remember Dumbledore from the, the prince? So, okay. Prince Farquaad, that was it, yeah. So we can actually cast... Oh, wait, this is coming to play untapped, so I can play this and then play Response Resurgence. Or... So this gives First Strike and Vigilance, so I can play this guy as a 2-1. Then you miss out on the sorcery. It's true. Keep on shining, Mac B. Like, having just a 6-5 with Menace that can attack twice is insane, because I'm going to take out this guy, and then I'm just going to deal you 6. Do it, do it. I'm just trying to figure out the best way to do it. To it. Now this is better because they can't actually block this guy, so it's just a free free damage. Wintermore Commander. Death touch for a 2 2. We already saw this guy. Oh, I guess they I guess they can block that guy. But now I get to eat both these guys, so that's kind of cool. And I get to draw another card. My god. My god. Thomas. What are you saying right now? Huh? What? What? Me, your golem ain't online. They got a double block. Keep on shining, Mark B. Also, it's September, so if you guys are new to the stream, I stream five days a week. And uh, for the month of September, you get to subscribe for two fifty instead of five dollars, which is a great deal. It's a great way to support streamers, so definitely try to take advantage of that if you guys can. And as I mentioned in most streams, uh, if you guys aren't on Twitch, if you guys are watching on YouTube, or if you guys don't want to make a Twitch account, or you don't have five dollars a month that you want to spend on Twitch subscription, definitely check out Patreon.com/slash Frank Lepore. I don't post a ton of content there, but it's a great way to support um, the stream or the YouTube channel or uh, my cool stuff ink articles, one of which just went up today. So uh, be sure to, you can head on over to Patreon, do a dollar or two dollars a month if you want to support the channel. And uh, considering 
I exclusively make content, it's a great way to support things like that. This enters with X11 counters, remove 10 counter, deal a certain R track. That actually seems insane. Okay, so basically. Okay, so what happened was. Okay, they're dead. I'm like, yeah, I can just play this, they deal, they lose one damage automatically, and then I can just. Oh god, Michael B is losing his mind. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at all these gifts. What's happening right now? Thank you. Alistair Kane with the four gifted subs. Thank you so much, buddy. Oh, Savvy Hunter. 3 3 for 3, which I'm already Thank on board with. When it attacks or blocks, create a food token, sacrifice two food tokens, draw a card. That seems great. Oh, that card's awesome. Thank you. Alistair Kane, thank you so much, buddy. J. Reynolds, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. It actually did cost 250. Sweet stuff. Okay, we need one more win. And then we're good to go. What are we playing? You wanna play this wild bounty again? Because you didn't see Maybe me the first time, yeah. Apparently you crushed with it. My UPS package was delivered. Yeah, I'll keep the same. It seemed good, huh? It's okay. Gorlami. Enemies MTGO, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate you. Thank you so much, dude. 11 months, we're so close to a year. Ooh, look at that guy. Oh yeah, that guy stays. You can stay. And you, you may go. So this is just peel from reality, right? Choose two creatures, control all different players from the owner's hand. So I could like boop boop, two boops. You can double boop. You can double boop. Wait, can you just use that to just bounce two of his creatures? No, they have to be controlled by different players. Okay. Can you imagine if it was like bounce two creatures from for the two? Player? That'd be really good, right? Because we've been playing this card like for five and six mana previously in like limited formats. I'm like six mana to bounce two creatures. Woo! It's your boy. Oh yeah, give me that free card. Boom. What? Hmm? I'm sorry, what? What? Hmm? What did you say? What? What did you say? Hmm? What? What did you say? What? Oh you're oh you're too big there. That was a good one. Wow, they were like played Corvold early here. I want a prison realm it. I'm going to send him back to the Shadow Realm. What you know about the Shadow Realm? So I have six mana so I can go Prison Realm, that's for sure. I do know that the Shadow Realm apparently is actually just being dead. And they didn't want to, in the American version, they, they didn't, didn't want to call it dead. Yeah. Um, I think I'll keep that on top because, boy, is it a good one. Tell me about the Shadow Realm. What do you want to know about it? I don't know. Just tell me about it. Get in there, you little, you little reefums. Yes, if you guys get gifted subs, um, please definitely consider renewing the sub because it's only 250 to renew if you get a gifted sub as well. Um, so it's a great way to support the channel. You can do whatever you like. Oh boy, that guy, that, that pig is going to win us a game eventually.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's play this tome. And let's play Chulane. Chulane? Hey man, Chulane. Would you lie to me? What? One, two. Ah. Uh, what? What are you saying right now? Thank you. Boom. So. Skeletal Cat with the gifted sub. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome, dude. That card, that card's great. The other one where there's some dodgy draw a card. My only condition is I encourage you to resub if you like Frank. Spoilers, we love Frank. Oh, you guys are great. I love you guys. I would marry all of you if I could. Would you? Maybe. This priest is killing it. Draws a card from the priest, draws two cards from the Mold Divine Reclamation. Look at his full grip over here, man. Skeletal Cat within our gifted sub. Really appreciate you, buddy. You'd marry us all? Well, I mean, it'd take a lot of work, but I'd, I'd try. I'd give it my best. Thank you. White Man Project, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Could you stare deeply into Mike's eyes and tell him he's beautiful? You're beautiful. Thank you. Oh God. Oh, God. Thank you. My discomfort mounts. Oh, you just killed my tome, huh? Skeletal cat with another gifted sub. You are awesome, read man. Read a book. 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 Yeah. Read. Why don't you read a book? Just read a book, okay? I won't tell you again. Oh, you can stay back. So now we have green, blue, green, blue. So now we can keep up Frilled Mystic. That's all I want. You can do whatever you like. What is that emotion? The emote. What, this one? Yeah. That's Bustin. Oh. It's Ray Parker Jr. Oh, Bustin makes me feel good. I didn't know you made an emote of that. Yeah, because it's Bustin. Bustin, Bustin, Bustin. I got you. Okay. Yeah, Chulane seems insane. I wrote about this card uh, for my Cool Stuff article about cube inclusions from this set. Uh, well, it was from Commander, right? This is one of the Commander cards. And um, I was like, yeah, this card seems insane. Pass. He's a little slow, but, you know, I just he's valuable. I just drew two cards and played two free lands. Uh, do I want to go to my turn or do I want to activate this guy? I'll activate this guy. Now they're gonna kill Chulane? Sure, that's fine. Chuli. Probably just kill him with that razor arm. Well, not yet, I don't think, but. You can do whatever you like. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten mana. So we can actually play this. We can't keep you up, though, unfortunately. Oh, yes, we can. No. No, we can't. Do you put any product in your beard? In my beard? Not regularly. I do have beard oil that I use on occasion, but otherwise, not a ton of stuff. Um, what are you going to your ear, man? You got a booger? Yeah. That's weird. Back of the year, booger. I put Cheeto dust in my beard. Well, you know, not intentionally, I imagine. One, two. One, two, three. Okay, we're just going to pass here. Uh, 
Um, yeah, that guy seems good enough to counter. God, they're at 26 life. Oh, that's interesting. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana. This is eight, so I can. Is this good enough? Did I just bust in there with an Enraged Forerunners? I think I do. Well, here we go. Here we go again on And their blocks are pretty bad here. Wow, I really thought I had to go number two, but only did a big farce. <laughs> <laughs> they died. And Ray's Forerunners is pretty good. It's basically Crater Huff Behemoth, guys. I don't know if you knew that. Are we done? This is Venom. Oh, yes. Inspiring Veteran. Other Knights get plus one, plus one. Look at this art. This art's fantastic. You got the little kid in the front. Hey, don't you have one more one to go? I don't know, man. I just work here. I guess so. Do we play the same deck? I guess we do. Uh, sure. Dang it! He was ready for it. Hey man, I don't have an uh, I don't have a back of the ear booger, but I do have like a a back of the ear booger, a gross ingrown something. I don't know what it is. What are you talking about? It's like under my arm. It's like a deep. It's like a zip, but I can't pop it. It's like under the skin. What are we talking about? Why did we get on this? I don't know. I just did. Just saying. It's terrible. What were you talking about in the ear booger? He just said, what are you doing back there trying to get a booger when I was picking up my ear? Where? No, that's what you said when I was up, when I was up in my ear. Did I? Yeah. I don't think I said that, man. You did. I don't think so, dude. I think you just made that shit up. Mike, what the fuck? <laughs> dude, Mike, see a doctor? <laughs> Well, the last time I saw a doctor, I didn't have it, so or at least I didn't know about it. Right, so that's why you'd see one now, because you do have it, because it exists now. Fair. Sometimes you say things and I'm like, okay, that's a factual statement, but it literally makes no sense, and I don't know why you said it. No, I'm going to go back to the doctor. I have an appointment follow up in a couple weeks, so. And you'll be dead by then. Oh, uh, yeah, that'll, yeah, uh, 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 a boil will kill me. It's probably got so much good bugs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. I tried to pop it, but it didn't work. Oh, Jesus again. Let's get an island. Listen, that's gross, and I'm more concerned about your health. If it's an abscess, it could actually be a big deal. Oh, Mike's gonna die. <laughs> Please at least spell bus correctly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Also, Spider View, it's not on my ear, it's like, it's like a uh, blow my armpit. It's below his armpit. It's an armpit. Abscess. I actually squeezed it so hard I made a bruise and it didn't do anything. Yikes. Probably have to lance that some bitch. Wow. <laughs> Jesus. Do a little homemade surgery. Just get in there, you know? Yeah, you just do it yourself, for sure. <laughs> what could go wrong? How could that go wrong? Well, as it turns out, when I cut myself open, it got infected, then I had to go to the doctor anyway, so I didn't die. <laughs> no lunch for me today. <laughs> this guy's gonna get bigger. He's gonna get bigger. I think we just want a time wipe here. Let's 
go to the hand. Oh, that's all right. You got no creatures on board? My man. Hmm. I can just take a turn off the uh, spider view. I do have a CPAP machine. Having trouble getting used to it. I mean, you have one night. I tried to pop, man. I squeezed it so hard, I made a bruise. No, he said it you can poop it. Oh, poop it. I don't know what that means. Yeah. How do you poop it? It's a question. It's a question we ask ourselves, man. Any reason you're on CPAP and not BiPAP? I don't even know what BiPAP is. I think that's a joke. Maybe it's not, actually. That sounds like a thing. Bipap covers nose and mouth. Okay. No blocks. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we can actually play Chile and then play Paradise Druid. Draw a card. Uh, yeah, definitely gonna land on the B field. It's too late, my queen. One has future tech laser eyes, the other has cyber sleep augmentation. Together they are cyborg <laughs> cube cops. <laughs> wow, that's perfect. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that sounds legit. First I was confused about the future tech laser eyes, and I was like, oh yeah, you had LASIK, that's what he means. Turn Ferguson, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. 15 months, really appreciate you. Many people have a hard time getting used to CPAP because it creates a resistance to exhale. Yeah, you can't exhale through your mouth or else it doesn't it doesn't work. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's mostly about just not being a little bitch about it, you know? Most likely has an APAP since it's auto-sensing. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm just going to keep frilled Missy up. Well, I'm gonna keep trying this thing. We'll see. There's some other options though. There's like this thing you can get that you put in your mouth, so it keeps your mouth like really open at night. And well, because your mouth is so too. small, right? Right. That's yeah, why they want you to keep, keep it, open. it open. So if I can't get used to the CPAP, I could probably do that. Keep that mouth wide open. Okay, it's not what? HVAC. Okay, that's not. <laughs> that's not <laughs> a thing. It took me a few days to not notice. Yeah, it's totally. totally it totally seems normal. Well, we'll see. I mean, what's the other option? You die in your sleep because you get 60% oxygen? Well. I wasn't often getting 60%. Normally, I was hovering around 85%. Oh, thank goodness. You were at 85%. I did then. hit 60 a couple times, but... That seems like more than more than enough, more than enough right? Just don't want the D's nuts, Pat. Wow. The DNP, AP? You could hire someone to breathe for you. I ain't got that kind of money. What are we eating, man? I don't know. It's only 520, man. Take it easy. I just like to know the future. You like to know the future? Yeah. Well, you'll never know the future. My turn now. I'm going to draw a card with this buddy. Turn the page. Breaking the boys talking about pus. All right. I'm going to head out. <laughs> Talk about pus and CPAP. Mike's like, where are we going to eat, man? I'm hungry. What if we do this right now? Do they we, they block here. They take one, two, three, four, five, six. They block here. They take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 13, 14. So six mana. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
We still have two mana left over. So let's do this for... No, let's just play it. Okay. Get him. Ocean Man. Woo! They blocked incorrectly. I think if they blocked correctly and then they just played this next turn, we would have lost. Because this is five. This is six, seven. This is eight. And then they have one extra damage from the knight attacking. And that would have been nine. So that was actually a pretty risky attack. Four Orders of Midnight. Oh, yes. We did it. Thank you guys for watching. I think uh, Thrones looks pretty sweet. And I like there's a lot of play between the, the adventure cards where, like, you want to decide whether to play them as a creature or play them as an adventure. Or, like, hold them and wait till, to adventure them later. And that's really good because it gives you a lot of, uh, like, gives you a lot of choices, a lot of interactions, a lot of options. Um, so it should be an interesting limited format. And uh, some of these cards look actually really, really broken for limited, like the one that makes 1-1 one, one flyers and draws you cards. It seems like there's a lot of card drawing in this format, but um, either way, we'll see. That was really fun. I, I had a good time, and uh, hopefully um, the set holds up when it's released. But thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on CoolStuffInc.com. I had a new article go up today about four really exciting modern decks, so you can check that out. And uh, feel free to check me out on Patreon.com or twitch.tv. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.